He soared against the yielding air, he leant against the sky. On earth the blossom froth of spring has scorched his inmost eye. His teeth met in the summer fruit, and let the teeming waste of the abundant juices scald his comprehending taste. Now flesh which was as foliage, which was as fine and firm, as lustre of the holly leaf, is gutted with the worm. It was a worm of discontent, with sap and sun and blood, a worm with inner sightless eye, crept to him from the mud. A worm that never saw the sky, nor praised the lark loud air, but conned his shapely skeleton, and swept each bright bone bare.